And coming up in Tech Tuesday, how to keep your computer from overheating. Well, every Tuesday, we check out the latest gadgets hitting the store shelves. So joining me now is Andy Taylor for today's Tech Tuesday segment. And Andy, uh, we were just talking about this, and you say, Jenny, your laptop is not for your lap. <laughs> no, it's, it's going to blow up. So he's kind of talking about <laughs> cooling systems today, right. huh, and, and what not to do. Well, we, we put a, posted a whole bunch of tips at KLD.com on really how to get, maximize performance for the computers by keeping them cool. When you put your laptop on your lap, there are fans in the bottom of the laptop. Yeah. Your legs block that airflow. Yeah. That laptop gets really hot. You're making it work harder, thus taking away some of the life and of that laptop. It kind of feels like it's going to burn your legs off. Yeah, and there have but been still people do it. who have burned their legs. So okay. there's a great answer for that and a couple of products. This is from Cooler Master. This is called the Notepal X1. Now what this does, this gives you a place to put your laptop. It's ergonomic. You can see how it's raised. You have some foot pads in the bottom of the unit. But what's really great about this one, this nice mesh screen that's on here, you have a 120 millimeter fan hooks up via USB oh. to your laptop, and you can control the speed of the fan so you're constantly blowing air on that. And in this case, you, still you, can't could put, put it, you could put it in your lap. You can't put this on your lap. Because awesome. you're keeping the, that airflow in the bottom of the laptop going. Now, something else to watch out for is you say smoking around oh. your computer. Killer what does it do to of, it? of You've systems. You've got an example here. This is a video card, $250 video card. And a smoker was using this. I pulled this out of a computer. Uh -huh. And what happens is that smoke and the dust gets inside your system and creates a gunk. It took out this fan. And this oh. fan's supposed to flow pretty freely, and it's, it's actually grinding. But it took out this fan. Wow. Thus, uh, blowing the graphics processor after a short amount of time. Uh, you know, she only had this in here for about a year and a half. So two hundred fifty dollars down the drain. It does to your drain. computer what it does to your body a little bit. Yeah, and you can tell it it, it it just makes it ugly looking too. It's not that good. <laughs> and this is today's technology. Here you have a cooling fan. This goes on your processor. Very important. But look at this. What's replacing this? This is called the V10 from Cooler Master. Great technology in this. Ten heat pipes. We need that in southern Arizona summers, here. huh? Absolutely. So there's some great tips up at KLD.com and really how to maximize your cooling for your system. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Andy. I will keep my laptop off my lap then. <laughs> Andy also has a great website, and we linked it up at KLD.com backslash this morning. Just click on Tech Tuesday, and you'll also find Andy's weekly articles there, and he talks a little bit more about the details of what we were talking about today. Scott and Aaron? All right. Pretty cool. Literally.